This video will discuss how to withdraw from a class using Navigate. It's important to understand what withdrawing means. Sometimes you may need to officially stop attending a class. If you do this in the first few days of the class, this can be done by dropping the course, which would be as if you never took the class at all. After the drop deadline, however, you would need to withdraw from the class in order to stop attending it and to keep yourself from receiving a failing final grade in the class. You can withdraw all the way until the final day of the class. So why would you need to withdraw from a class? You may be struggling academically with a class and you do not want to receive a final grade of F. You might have something come up in your life that will keep you from finishing the class. It's important to know that a withdrawal will show up on your transcript from TTC, but it is not a failing grade and it does not affect your grade point average. So what should you consider before withdrawing from a class? It may still be possible for you to pass your class. Talk to your instructor to see if this is the case. Withdrawing can affect your financial aid. It can count against your completion rate for financial aid satisfactory academic progress. You should contact the financial aid office before you withdraw to understand how you will be affected. You should also consider talking to your navigator or academic advisor to discuss how withdrawing from a class will affect your progress through your program of study. Now we will log in to Navigate and look at the steps for withdrawing from a class. So when you look at Navigate, you can go to Class Schedule on the left hand side from the Navigate homepage to see what you're registered for. So if this particular student wanted to withdraw from English 101, then we will look at how that is done. You will go up to Planner at the top of the page. And then we're going to look at the right hand column and go down to the 2022 spring one. And we see that this student is enrolled in the English 101. So we're going to click view edit schedule. When the schedule comes up, you will see that English 101 is populated in this area. We can click on this course and go down to Withdraw. This gives you some information on what you need to consider before withdrawing, and if you want to continue with the withdrawal, you'll click Withdraw from Course, and that will take you out of the course, and you will be officially withdrawn.